In Energy is doing this hackathon because uh, we think it's a real a good way to bring a new wave of innovation, of out-of-the-box thinking uh, to the wind energy sector. We need innovation also on how we create solutions. And the hackathon has not been tried before. France, uh, Russia, Italy, Denmark, the Netherlands. I'm a theoretical physicist, data scientist, designer, control engineer, meteorologist. I'm a student at U Delft. In this hackathon, we are working now on two main challenges of the wind energy sector. One is linked to uh, the diagnosis and prognosis of wind turbines. The other one is linked to uh, how accurate we are in predicting wind speeds. The two tasks they have been given are difficult, but they could give elements of solutions that the professionals didn't come up with yet. We met up today and we discovered that they had an amazing idea for solving this problem. I want to see like how we can leverage our skills. I'm kind of testing myself here because I've never done things like that before. I'm meeting new people, learning new things from these people. Could you raise your hand if you actually work during the night? Is there someone that... <laughs> I would also like to ask you to thank our uh, two main organizers, Wind Europe and Inno Energy, together with the help of EDP, who provided you with a challenge, and Envision, who have provided you with the Envision platform. There are several prizes uh, that will be uh, given to the winners. We've seen a lot of interest in the sector and we really want to build on that interest for the next years to uh, follow up on this kind of activities. So.